hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tupo if you're new here welcome 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 please subscribe like comment give me a thumbs up guys today i'm going to be showing you how to achieve this long gorgeous crochet hair no leave out so if you guys want to see how i achieve this look please continue watching working with these old cornrows that I used from my previous video so what I'm gonna do is I'll start by taking my Jamaican black castor oil mixing with my coconut oil just to make sure my hair is really nice and moisturized or whatever and then I'm going to be using this Cuban twist double strand style this is 16 inches this is color 1b and I'm using two packs guys okay so this is how the hair comes I'm just gonna take it out of the pack and then I'm going to be taking one strand and then I'm going to be dividing that into three pieces all right guys so I want this hair to look as natural as possible so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start from the sides I want to show you guys how you can achieve this style if you put it up and it looks like really natural you're just gonna place the needle in going downwards exactly the way I'm doing and then you're going to open the crochet hook place the crochet hair on the hook and then close it and then you're going to pull it out once you pull it out guys you're just going to pull one strand in so you're going to pull one strand in that way when you pull it up when you pull your hair up it actually looks like your natural hair okay so you're gonna have the little knot on the top right there instead of you know going on the bottom you know just like a regular knot so I'm doing this technique all around my perimeter so i'm gonna show you guys again you're going to place the crochet needle in okay open the hook taking my crochet hair placing it on the hook and then pulling it out okay so once i pull it out i'm just gonna take one strand you're gonna place it in and then pulling it out you guys can see that the back has like two lines they're curved they're not like straight all the way down because i wanted to be able to put my hair up in a bun guys so this is why i'm doing this but if you don't want to put your hair in a bun you can just do like really um straight corners going all the way to the back why we're still talking sis have you subscribed to my channel don't forget to turn on your notification button so you do not miss out on any uploads because this channel is getting what juicy yes sis Today's shout out goes to Latoya Lucien. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right, sis. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Thank you for rocking with me. Thank you for all the love. I really, really appreciate it. You are a real one today. Okay, sis. As you're going round you know as you're going around your head you got to make sure you're coming very close together that way it looks really nice and realistic and then once you get to the middle it's just gonna be the basic you know method that you guys already know how to do just place the crochet needle in open the hook taking your crochet here placing it on the hook pulling it out taking both strands and then pulling them in just the way I'm saying it very very easy achieve like you know long hair don't care kind of situation this is the way to go like sis my hair is not gonna grow this long sis i know but you know what i'm gonna fake it till i make it okay <laughs> As you guys can see on the sides you gotta make sure you're coming as closer you know to your hairline as much as possible it doesn't have to be like all the way to your hairline guys because you don't want to break your hair or anything like that sis when i tell you this took me 30 minutes to do listen this is me wishing wishful thinking honey i'm over here thinking oh child if my hair ever grew this is how i've been rocking it okay You want to look natural you want to have like a natural hair situation going on you better do this technique and then once we get to the end i'm going to show you guys how to really really make this as realistic as possible but also you want to be able to have hair that you can actually you know rock in different styles here and there or whatever you know what i'm saying 
So I'm gonna show you guys again. You're going to place the crochet needle in, okay? Open the hook, placing your crochet here on the hook and then pulling it out. So once you pull it out, you're going to take one strand, guys. You're gonna place it in and then pulling it out. So the knot is going to be on the side where the hair is not going to be showing. So you wanna have like an illusion, um, the crochet illusion method right here. That way it looks like it is your natural hair assist. So once I get to where I'm trying to part the hair, I'm going to be doing the technique that I just showed you from the sides. Exactly the way I'm doing. So what I'm doing is I'm just gonna place the crochet needle in, open the hook, taking my crochet hair, placing it on the hook, and then pulling it out, okay? So once I pull it out, I'm just gonna take one strand and then you're going to place it in, okay? So you're gonna place it in and then pulling it out. Very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Anybody can actually do this, sis. And this right here, I mean, no leave out. That's the only reason why I love this hair. This is a very good protective style because there is no hair that you are living out, sis. And this right here is gonna be protected. The good thing about this Cuban twist, honey, it is very, very light. It is very, very easy to use. So yeah, I love this hair and it actually looks like my natural hair. So that's a bonus right there. Once I'm done, I'm just gonna take my scissors and make sure I shape my face or whatever. It's not as bulky. It actually, you know, it looks really good like my natural hair. But you guys already know I love me some big hair, don't care. But don't worry, we are gonna fix everything and I'm about to be looking cute out in the streets, okay. So I'm just gonna take my Diana brush just to make sure you know this is really nice and realistic. I'm going to be doing the illusion method, okay? Just gonna brush the front, you know, on the sides, you know, a little bit that way. The hair looks a little fuzzy, like it is actually my natural hair. And do you know me? I gotta make sure my baby hair is LA just a little bit because I was trying to go for a natural, natural look. And baby, when I tell you, this hairstyle came all the way through. Yes, sis, I am living for this hair right here. Let me know if you guys are living for this crochet illusion hair, natural looking goddess hair right here. I am looking like an African queen and I am loving it. This looks like Miss Tupo just grew her hair overnight. I mean, you guys already know I gotta give you some styles here and there. And baby, these styles are coming all the way through. Quick, easy styles and you are out the door. And as I was telling you, I'm going to be using my brush again, my Diana brush on the back right here and the sides. And just to make sure the hair looks really nice and legit once I pull it up in a bun just the way I did right here. And it actually looks like my natural hair since it looks really nice and realistic. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying it. Let me know if you guys are loving it. Let me know in the comments below if you think this is a hot style right here, sis. Thank you guys so, so much for watching my videos. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for all the love. I cannot believe we are here today. We are at 330K. Woo! Thank you from the bottom of my heart. You guys already know how I feel about each and every one of you. Thank you so, so much. Make sure you share this with your cousin, your bestie, your mama, and your aunt. Because sharing is caring. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye!